good weekend guys and welcome back sa akin channel. Welcome again sa bagong episode sa ating weekend kitchen. So doon sa mga bago dito sa akin channel, every weekend nagpo-post ako ng mga dishes na alam ko at isinishare ko dito sa akin channel. So for today's uh, weekend kitchen, isishare ko naman sa inyo guys kung paano ako gumawa ng sweet and sour fish. So let's get started. Itong sweet and sour dish na ito is uh, natutunan ko nung nagtatrabaho ako sa Taiwan. Ito na yung mga kakailanganin natin para dito. So you will be needing two medium sized tilapia. Of course you could use any kind of fish that you want. And it's up to you how many fish you want to use for this dish. You will be also needing some onion, garlic, ginger, and white sugar. And a little bit of ketchup some carrots, vinegar, and red bell pepper. And also some salt and pepper to season. Start by seasoning your fish with uh, a little bit of salt and pepper. You can also add some other seasoning if you want, just like what I did. After seasoning your fish, just set it aside for a few minutes. You can now start frying your fish. Just make sure that your cooking oil is hot enough so that your fish won't stick on your frying pan. After frying both sides of the fish, try to remove as much oil as you can. Set your fried fish aside and now let's start with the sauce. Preheat your pan and add a little bit of oil. Now you can add your onion, garlic, and ginger. Let it sweat for a few minutes and then add your vinegar. You can now also add 2 cups of water. Put your lid on. Wait for it to simmer and then add your ketchup. After adding the ketchup, mix it a little bit and then you could add on your white sugar. And after that, just give it a mix and wait for it to simmer. You can now also add your carrots 
and red velvet. Season with salt and pepper and you can also use other seasoning just like what I did. I forgot to mention this on the start of the video. We will be also needing some cornstarch. Just mix 2 tablespoons of cornstarch to a 1 fourth cup of water. Just carefully add it on. This will make your sauce thicker. So if you don't want your sauce to be too much thick, make sure to add your cornstarch gradually. Let the sauce simmer for a few minutes and add your fried fish. Just make sure to mix it a little bit so that the fish will absorb the flavor of the sauce. Cook it for a few minutes on a low flame and after that you can now transfer it to a serving plate and serve it to your family and friends. So there you have it guys. Uh, sana nagustuhan nyo itong video na to and kung nagustuhan nyo nga, please uh, give it a like and share it uh, if you want and uh, if you're new to my channel, uh, please subscribe to my channel and uh, hit the notification bell para updated ka every time na nagpo-post ako ng mga bagong video. So that's it guys and uh, I'll see you again next weekend and have a nice day. Bye!